Mercenary Field in Chirac, Illinois is the setting for today's MFL action. The historic site is where aliens first made contact with Earth, landing their spaceships inside the stadium and demanding a lifetime supply of Italian beef sandwiches. Today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams take the field. The Los Angeles Dams battle. The Midway Mutants. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Tune in, turn on, and drop what you're doing, because NFL Game Day is on the air. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. So what's the game plan for the home team today, Bricks? Uh, I think they got to keep it simple. A little cough syrup, maybe smoke a little untidy pod pregame so they can keep their heads in the game. I mean, literally. You don't want to get decapitated on the opening kickoff. I say go after the rest early and often. No mercy. And the quarterback unleashes a sonic blast again. First down! I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. You can't keep a good mutant down. Oh, he just got crushed. And it's first and ten. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. Second down and long. And that'll bring up 
third and one. And they'll line up for the punt here. A misfired punt will give the opposing team great field position. And he just lets that one go. He says, no, thank you. And the defense downs it. And it's first and ten. And that player just transformed into a giant. Good luck blocking the... And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. Second and three. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. Oh, devastating hit! You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep, third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And it's first and ten. Like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. Second down and ten. Oh, man, the defense brought a sack lunch today. Hey, hey, don't eat him. Not until he's cooked. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. Third down and, well, good luck. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Hunter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is in palm cream. That cross stitching, unbelievable. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Second 
taken down in a lot. Caught for the first down. And it's first and ten. Like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my off season. Second and three. <laughs> he hit that line the way a Republican congressman hits the airport men's room. Good and hard. First down. And it's first and ten. First down. See if they can get something going here. First and eight to go. And that's just a great run for a touchdown. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and get the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. Four yards on that one, and he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second down and six. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Talking about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Third down and six. He picks up five on that play. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. And he put all of his foot into that one. They just let that one drop and played safe, and the defense says, we'll take it. And it's first and ten. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. Two minutes remain in the half. Wait, I gotta take a dump. And it's first and ten. And they pick up nine with that catch. Uh, not enough for a first, but still a nice game. The offense calls a timeout. This is why you save your timeouts. You can use them in the two-minute warning. Now I get it. Makes sense, Grim. And that'll bring up second and one. Well, that's 
two timeouts burned. And you have to wonder, Bricks, are they crit or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Quinn. But it was hard to both at the same time. And I have mastered it. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. The quarterback burns his last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. And it's first and ten. He broke free and has open field in front of him. And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. <laughs> I know, I hate those zebra men. <laughs> And this is a first and, and they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. <laughs> first down and forever. They pick up a nice chunk of yards on that pass play. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. Catches it for a touchdown! What a beautiful play! Yeah, it's almost poetic, man! Like a haiku! Yeah! You know, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights! When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And he breaks away. And it's first and ten. Not one. You know, this preserve dirty trick ain't fair to the QB here. Ain't nothing worse than wasting a good explosive. Yeah. <laughs> Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two minute drill. Hot two. Hot. up a lot of yards on that pass play. They'll need to regroup quickly. At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsatan Industries. Makers of great killer products like Ground Up. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. The third quarter is about to start as the teams take the field. This game has been one lopsided route. Yeah, football games are kind of like boobs. Big or small, they're both great. Yeah. Except for when they're lopsided. I'm a high-scaling seller. I am a hell of a seller. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. And like Bricks' bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot 
Second down in a mile. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. Third down and the punter is warming up. First and ten. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Second down and six. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it too. Third down and six. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. No, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole up here. Talking to you. Hot. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Be second down and four. I think the defenders are scared of this guy, Bricks, and they have every right to be. Yeah, he's a murderer! And it's first and ten. First and ten. Good thing they don't have drug testing in the MFL because whatever they juice and they stack the line and he gets his bell run for a yard. Second down and nine. First and ten. And he runs it for four yards. Second down and six. Nice catch for five yards. And that'll bring up third and one. And that is caught for a first down.
First and eight to go. Second down and long. Third down and long. Defense gives up five yards on that pass play. The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. Straight through the uprights. Another bullshit penalty. How long are these guys going to take this? <laughs> If they don't pick it up here, and the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref, they say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. <laughs> well, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. Well, that's a lovely shake for the punter today. He just put his team in the... No return on this punt. The defense will just down it. I can't tell if he's smart as... That's the end of the third quarter. And look, folks, I'll be honest. I don't see a chance in hell in here. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of... ...or take a timeout to stop the clock. He had it for a second there. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. How did he screw that up? No one died. Bombs don't kill mutants, Grim. Newtons kill mutants. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage, and oh, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Catch the ball, asshole. Oh, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, don't, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabag after that hit. And it's first and ten. And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there. Second down and two. What? I mean, first down! What the hell was that? I, uh, I honestly don't know, Grim. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. First down and nine. Whenever a player gets big like this for a mic, and he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done! And here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. 
Gun. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Shifts gears and goes into his hurry up offense. Hot two. Hot. And there's an eight yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes. I like it. Like a patient prison break. Hot. Hot one. Hot. Oh, sure. Now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him. Not to mention my kneecaps. My lung shark is very anal about collecting my money on time. Oh, with a punishing hit. Second down and nine. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Third down and the punter is warming up. Running game is starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. There's no reason to go for it here, but they do anyway. And that play didn't have a chance. The defense comes up with a big stop on fourth down. And it's first and ten. The brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. One potato, two potato, three potato, four. The defense just blew up a player who thought he was going to score. <laughs> oh, that hot potato dirty trick gets him every time. And it's first and ten. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Oh! He's going berserk. The ball carrier better walk. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Oh, man. Bricks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. It's a touchdown! When skeletons make it to the end zone in one piece, that's always cause for celebration. here just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake the kick is good as expected those are pretty much just gimmies when you get knocked down you got to get right back up and fight and what about when you get knocked up what do you do then run
The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Brits' ex girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. I took it as a compliment. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first, and they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Grim? Aren't we all? The defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. Second down, and they stop the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Uh, that's okay, Grim. Thank you that line. That's, uh, that's nice, Briggs. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. One, two, nine, nine, three. And he catches it for six yards. Good mitts on that play, Briggs. His fingers are like a bunch of sausages. And that's it. That's the last timeout. It's score or die from here out. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. It's a touchdown! That's his dance? My floor wizard vacuum bot has better moves. I think you my vacuum a lot, Grim. That's not wrong, is it? It is when you make it dinner and buy perfume, you partner. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. He'll be going onside here, and the return team is ready for it. No surprises here. First and ten. And he held on to that one for a first down. And it's first and ten. Ball. First down. And this field goal is certainly within the kicker's range. The mutants walk away defeated. The score says it all, but it wasn't even that close. They got blown out at home. Fans left by halftime to forget the game and start watching the new Game of Bones on NBO. You know, I watched that on my phone, too. Oh, let's go down to the field and see how badly the MVP rubs it in. <laughs> Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every other...